What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? Today, we are here to talk about the Corsair OPX Mechanico Optical Switch, which is uh, what I have right here. I have a stock one. I'm going to take it apart, show you the pieces on the insides, and then I'll show you the difference between a lubed and filmed OPX switch and a stock OPX switch. Comes apart just like a normal mechanical switch. So if you have a switch opener, nice and easy for you to get it open. I'm not sure of the specs of it, uh, like the spring and all that. Uh, I've tried to look it up online and couldn't find it, but um, here's your bottom housing. Uh, very similar to a, a standard mechanical switch, except here you see it's missing a leaf. So, uh, do what you want with that. Um, here's gonna be your stem. It's a standard linear stem. Silver in color. Let's see if I can get a little closer for you. And then your top housing is what one would call clear or translucent. And then your standard uh, spring, which is very light. These switches are very light. I want to say they're somewhere between 30 and 50 grams. Um, they're actually nice to the touch. I like typing on them. They're just uh, stocked stock without any lube or film uh very clacky you can they're pinging around you, you'll, you'll hear the difference here so in my hand in my right hand i have the stock switch in my left hand i have a lube and film switch the films are just uh kvd films nothing special so uh see if you can hear the difference stock film or uh, stock switch Lubed and film switch. And the scratch is almost non-existent if you lube these. It's really nice. Again, stock. Lubed and filmed. Hope you find this informational. Um, if uh, please, if you can, please like and subscribe to my channel for more information on uh, all king things, mechanical keyboards, electronics, etc., etc. Have a good day, y'all.